Coach, coming off of a match at uh, a tough team at Rice, so what you what good did you see out of that match? We did well in doubles. We uh, we won number one doubles, number three doubles. We were close to winning. We had a couple break points there at the end, and we ended up losing it in the tiebreaker. So real happy with the doubles there. In the singles, we kind of fell off. We went indoors after the first set and struggled with that. We hadn't practiced indoors since uh, I don't think we've ever practiced indoors actually. So. It's been tough. Uh, it's been tough just uh, coming back from that indoor match and, and coming out here with the wind and everything and trying to prepare um, for the match. But you know, going back to the Rice match, I think we got a lot of positives out of the doubles, and, uh, and we're going to look forward to playing some good doubles here against Laredo tomorrow. What does it say about the progress your team has made from last year to this year that you can go up against a ranked team and give them a run for their money? It says a lot. I think the guys have improved quite a bit over the last year and feel good about the progress we've made. I think that it says says a lot for what they've been doing in the offseason and the hard work we've been putting in in practice. And Sebastian Job and Alejandro Sanoa really uh, repaid your faith in them, moving them up to the number one double spot by picking up that win. Yeah, I had an injury at number one doubles. Ricardo Hopker was out, uh, sprained his wrist, so we had to put Sebi and uh, Alex in at one, and they did a great job. They've been playing two, and uh, they stepped it up. They played a great match on the stadium court there, and it was an exciting match, and they pulled it out 8-6. I think it was uh, one break that they, they broke there at the end, and yeah, real proud of the, the effort they gave that day. Last year, you didn't get home until nearly the end of the season. This year, a whopping 10 home matches, and you're about to start a stretch of six out of seven at home. Yeah, yeah, it's nice to play some home matches get to sleep in our own bed the night before, have the other team do the traveling. It's good. I think it's definitely an advantage. Uh, sometimes when these teams come a long way, it's it's tough for them to to recover from that long trip and then come out and play good tennis. So it's definitely somewhat of an advantage for us. And, and vice versa, when we're traveling, it's, it's tough. So it's nice to be at home and sleep in our own beds. Laredo Community College, the opponent, they're a team that uh, they're nationally ranked at the junior college level, and uh, they give a lot of teams, uh, whether at their own level or Division One level, a run for their money, and they typically knock off a few uh, uh, higher-level teams every single year. So that uh, certainly be a, a tough match coming in tomorrow. Yeah, it should be a tough match. We're looking forward to it. Last year they beat us, and they won the national championship last year in their division. So they're always a good team, and uh, looking forward to that tomorrow.